What is the meaning of this? The meaning of what? I ordered this task to be completed an hour ago. Yeah, you did. You have failed me for the last time. That's what you said the last time. I have been too forgiving in the past. Do not fail me again. Because that'll be the last time. Yes. No. Uh, I don't know. Continue stalking. I speak with you a moment, my master. It's just Randy, okay, Chad? Yes, my master. And don't kneel, it's weird. I have grave news. Tammy, I need you to work an extra shift on Saturday. No. Then she walked away. Okay, so? Our plans to make this station fully operational on Saturday may be jeopardized. Look, uh, just get someone to take your shift, okay, Chad? As you wish. Oh, Chad, uh, I heard you're having some problems with Clint. Clint is a fool, and I will not tolerate his insolence much longer. Well, you're going to have to resolve it. I can't have my day manager and my night manager at each other's throats all the time. Yes, Emperor. It's Randy! Randy! I'm not an emperor. <laughs> Clarissa, I noticed your shift ends at six o'clock tonight. Yeah, Lord Vader. Please, call me Chad. Yes, Chad. I would like you to meet me at Gino's Pizzeria facility to, um, discuss some plans I have for a more powerful laser checkout system. And for dinner. What? I... Here. These are for you. Oh! Um, thank you, Lord... I mean, Chad. I will return to this workstation at 6 p.m. to pick you up. I have a date. Chad has a date. Hey, Chad! I just heard you and Clarissa are going out on a date. It is not a date. It is purely to discuss the laser checkout system. Yeah, I bet you want to check out her laser system, eh, Chad? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh. Jesus, what is your problem? Apology accepted. Dick? on the staff again, huh, Chad? Clint, we meet again at last. The circle is complete. You don't get along with your employees too well, do you? No. Maybe you should try being less of a butthole. <laughs> How dare you? I hear you can't even keep this joint staffed on Saturday night. If you can't handle doing the schedule, sweetie pie, then maybe Randy should give it to someone who knows what the crap they're doing. I will not tolerate that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just keep not tolerating, Chad. Keep on screwing the pooch. And I'm gonna pull that sweet little day manager position right up from under your big sweaty ass! Now you will feel the full power of the. Oh, my back! Could you help me up? <laughs> Day manager of this facility, what is the nature of your distress? I bought these chips here and they're stale. Yes, I can feel your anger. It is 
strong inside you. Um, I want my money back. Release your anger. Only your hatred can destroy me. Yeah. Can I talk to someone else? Strike me down with your hate and claim your refund. Did I say these were stale? I think they're great. Weak-minded fool. Your powers are nothing compared to Chad Vader to aisle 5 for vomit cleanup. Chad to aisle 5 for vomit. It occurs to me that the two of you require additional instruction to complete your training. Yes, Lord Vader. I've been here two years. I don't require any- I find your lack of faith disturbing. I will pretend to be a customer, and you will respond to me in the appropriate manner. Commander Edwards. It's Tony. I was wondering if you could direct me to the frozen foods aisle. We're standing in it. Search your feelings. Feel the answer. I don't need to search my- Commander Wickstrom. I'll find, sir. Most impressive. This is stupid. We're not done yet. I sense potential in you, young one. Yeah! I shall take you on as my apprentice, Jeremy. Together we shall decimate the competition and conquer the food retailing industry. That would be awesome! Yes, it shall be awesome. Oh, uh, I- Hmm. Clean that up, Jeremy. Sorry I'm late. Clarissa, thank you for joining me on our date. I mean, meeting. So, you wanted to talk about some laser system or something? Are you having a nice time? I just got here. Of course. I command you to bring us menus. So, I've always wondered. What's up with the suit and the helmet? I... I was in a biking accident. You ride a motorcycle? No, a bicycle. I lost control on a road and I went over an embankment, down a hill, and into a volcano. Oh my gosh! But my brother... I have a famous brother. He sent me this suit. I can never remove it, or I will die. I don't like to speak of it. Oh, you poor thing! That must be awful! Yes. I command you to bring us a basket of bread. Hey, Clay! Hey, my man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, I heard that you and Chad got into a fight. <laughs> fight? I was standing. Chad was flailing around on the ground like a freaking turtle. <laughs> no. Turtle. I tell you, if Randy was here... Oh. Excuse us, Lloyd. Randy and I got something important to talk about. Hey, Jack! How was your meeting with Clarissa? It was not a meeting. It was a date. And I am in love! Yeah, I bet you'd like to... get some... love. I sense a disturbance in the store. He's underqualified. He's rude to the customer. He's got an an attitude. I want that job, Randy! I know, Clint, but Chad has seniority, and I feel like I, I need to just just give him one more chance. What I want you to do is... Chad, God damn it! I told you to stop spying on me with your hand! No, no, I, I, you, you misunderstand. I, it's not what it seems. I... Look, Chad, this is the last straw. I've given you too many chances already. I'm going to have to give Clint the day manager position. You'll have to take over the night shift. Sorry. F yeah! yeah. Welcome to the night shift, Chad. <laughs>
the waxing on the floor is complete. Huh? Can someone have this droid repaired? Shift manager. 25 cents. A can. What? Tomato sauce. It's on sale. That lady bought like 10 cans. She saved a lot. Uh, what lady? She was here about an hour ago. She saved a lot. Yes. Well, I must return to Muffins, my. Muffins. Swiss cheese. Roast beef. Okay. Hey, do you like light bulbs? Commander Wickstrom reporting for duty, sir. I have grave news. Where'd you get that hat? Thank you for transferring to the night shift, Jeremy. There's, there's Your a... assistance will be instrumental in my plan to regain the day manager position from Clint. This will be a night long remembered. There's a guy sleeping on the meat. Let's hit it. My meat pillow. You cannot sleep in this establishment. Clint used to let me. Clint is no longer the night manager. I am. You're a bad night manager. He's right. Lord Vader! Now, Jeremy, remember the plan. I There's was... somebody shoplifting in aisle seven. No. Kill. Because it is the middle of the night does not make this store your personal trash heap. Ugh, I hate the night shift. You're doomed. 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 This is bullshit. Hello. Clarissa. Oh, hi, Chad. You did not arrive for our second date last night. I waited for an hour. Yeah, I'm sorry, Chad. Something came up. I see. Would you like to meet me after work? My shift ends at 6 a.m. Yeah, um, no, that's not gonna work, Chad. But I was certain we had something. I searched my feelings. Um, All of them. I'm sorry, Chad. I, I have to go. I'll see you later. Wait, don't go. Teresa? Hello? <sighs> oh! Huh? Looks like somebody got <laughs> shot down! <laughs> Clint, go away. I bet you'd like your old job back, wouldn't you, you big turd? I shall not be the night manager for much longer. I think you're gonna be the day manager. Think again, Charlie Brown. It's not gonna happen. You hear me in there, honey? <laughs> Don't me. me! You, you started, started it! it. <laughs> You're gonna pay for this, you a-hole! Nobody touches Clint Shermer's neck and lives. Oh, and guess who's taking out your little sweetie pie tomorrow night? What? <laughs> Oh, 
Excuse me, where are your live chickens? We do not carry that item. I found some frozen ones, but they won't work for my voodoo ritual. We do not carry that item. But where are they? I told you already, we do not have live chickens. Does this look like a chicken coop? Do not ask me where they are, because they are not here. You're a bad and mean man, and I didn't like where you were angry, and I didn't, and I didn't care for how your words assaulted me. Lord Vader, come quick! There's a dog loose in the store! A dog? I want this canine captured immediately. Alive, if possible. Commander Wickstrom, take your squadron and find that dog. Do not return. Out it. Um, I'm not supposed to leave the cash register. Randy's orders. He says I wander. I gotta go clean the septic tank. <laughs> right. I'm gonna take my my squadron and uh, and go find that dog. Here, doggy, doggy. Hey, uh, could you? She dumped you, didn't she? How did you? You and I have a lot in common, Chad. I used to be the day shift manager here at Empire Market. Then they made me the night shift manager, just like you. Soon after, I developed some mi minor problems. <clears throat> now, my life is over. Well, I must go back inside now. Chad, it doesn't have to be like this. You always have a choice. Unless you're me. <laughs> <laughs> You're saving a lot. Yeah, you always say that. And you always save a lot. Have you Lord Vader, can anything travel faster than the speed of light? No, I've told you already, nothing is faster than the speed of light. And the speed of light wins. Yes, fine. Have you seen Commando Extra? I can't catch him, Lord Vader! The dog. I want that dog, not excuses. He's too fast! Uh, apparently I'm the only one who can do anything around here. You did not pay for that. Get back here, you... Chad, you caught the dog. How did this creature get into this facility in the first place? Well, it's my dog. We need to talk. Return the day shift to me, Randy. You do not realize the power I possess. Together we could rule Empire Market as general manager and day manager. Come on, Chad. You've had a rough first night. Let's go into my office. You will join me or die. You really mean that, Chad? No. 
please give me my day shift back. This is silly. Silly? How dare you? I have given everything to this store. It is all I care about. But I get nothing in return but treachery and contempt. It appears there is nothing left for me here. I quit. Come on, Chad. Goodbye. Ready for another chocolate tini? Yes, make it a double. A little early to be drinking so much, eh? I love chocolate teenies. They are my favorite little playmate. They don't betray you. <laughs> Sorry, Chad, I have to go. And guess who's taking out your little sweetie pie tomorrow night? Good. I quit. So that job meant a lot to you, huh? Yes, she did. She? Clarissa. My supposed former girlfriend is out on a date with my arch enemy, Clint. But you know, they're sitting right over there. <sighs> yes, I know. You know what's gonna happen next time? Yeah, like that. You like my fist, sweetie pie? All up in your face? He really isn't that bad. Not that bad? Have you seen my neck? It's all grabbed. That son of a bee grabbed me. So what's up, you having a good time or what? Get out of my way, chair. Thank you. Excuse me, madam. What a coincidence. Two little lovebirds are having their little date. You better not mess with our date, drunkie. You got that? Maybe I should mess with your face a little bit. You got that? Stop it, you two. Oh, you want some of this? Yeah. Well, come get it. That's right, it's feeding time. My fists are the meals. I'm gonna go to the can, shake the weasel. I want him gone by the time I get back. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Chad, what are you doing here? Just having a little drink. Care to join me? Another one over here. I think it's kind of lame that you came here to spy on us. I spy on people every day and I don't need to go where they are to do it. Check it out. It's Randy. He's sleeping. I, I saw you following us. No, you didn't. Stop lying. Chad. How does it feel to be such a liar? Why don't you do something with your life and stop being so lame? I can't help it, Clarissa. I'm lame. Lame. Hey, if you're bothering a lady, you're going to have to leave, all right? I think you've had enough. Yes, I have had enough. I've had enough of you. I've had enough of you. I've had enough of all of you. You can all kiss my butt. Yes, kiss it big time. No one's going to be bothered by Chad Vader ever again. <laughs> Yes, I'll do something with my life. I'll end it. How's that for doing something with my life, Clarissa? Oh, it's sick. Chad, I'm very disappointed in you. What? Who's that? Hey, Chad, I heard you were gonna jump off a bridge. I'll jump too, let's jump! <laughs> jump, you rat! Hey, you guys, when he jumps, you should totally have him scream. No! Just like in episode three of Star Wars. I told you you were doomed. You're right. Yeah, suicide. It's a solution for me. I'm going to have to go right over. Stop. Do not jump, Chad Vader. Hmm? I 
have a ghost mm. and a friend. I died on this very night, long ago. You jumped off this bridge too? No. I was killed in a drunk driving accident. You got hit by a drunk driver? No, I was drunk. I blew myself up running over a gas pump. Oh. I've always regretted it, Chad. And I'm here to tell you, you only get one chance to live. Don't let this bridge be your gas pump. I don't understand. Chad, do something with your life, and stop being so lame. That's the same thing Clarissa said to me. Yes, she's a very smart and hot girl. So I'm meant to be with her then? No, no, sorry, no. Oh. I must go now. Do not forget what I have told you. And don't jump off the bridge. You got it, ghost. That's strange. I, I need to do this to disappear. Believe me, I don't make the rules. Clarissa's is right. I need to make something of my life. I need to get another job. Hello? Uh, hello? Good afternoon, Mr. or Mrs. Grizz. Yes, Grizzy. yes. Grizzy. Mr. Would you call yourself fully satisfied with your long distance carrier, Mr. Grizzy? Mr. Grizzy, how do you pronounce this name? You people aren't even supposed to call me after 7 o'clock. I looked it up. I will go ahead and switch your long-distance service for you. There may be a slight... I, I never said I wanted to switch long-distance carriers. I am altering the deal. Pray I don't alter it any further. What deal? The, uh, the deal. The long-distance deal. I'm hanging up now. You are beaten. You're an idiot. You think you have won this round, eh? Wait until I send a service droid to your house to destroy your communication. Hey, Chad. What? It's not working out. Fine. If you want to fire me after one phone call, fine. I don't care. Your resume seems to be in order. And your former boss, Randall, highly recommends you. Huh. How gracious of him. Right. So. In light of your managerial experience, and of course, your disability. What disability? We've decided to give you the job. Congratulations. At last, my return to power is complete. Who on this station will serve me? I require lackeys immediately. Lackeys? Yes, lackeys. Oh, I get it. Good one. Well, all your lackeys are all the copy machines on this floor. Copy machines? What do you mean, error 412? I've checked the manual. There is no such error, you stupid copy machine. Now do my job. Do my job. appears to be broken. Chad, it's not working out. <sighs> Chad! Chad, it's me, the ghost, remember? What do you want? Why are you here? Don't you know that the store is where you belong? I am never going back to that place! Never! <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's all right, he's all right. My, my, my fault. My knee!
You remember the time that Chad almost burned down the bread department? <laughs> yeah! What are you guys talking about? Remembering all the crazy stuff Chad used to do, which she'll never do again because of me? <laughs> That's right, you meatheads. Now quit your lip flapping. Lloyd, coffee. Right away, Lloyd. You. I told you that stupid helmet is not in the dress code. I want to see some transacting of the business. And that includes you, meathead. Don't call me a meathead. Meathead. They went out on a date. I want to see some work out of all you meatheads. Are you all going to be in deep doo doo? Kind of makes you miss Chad, doesn't it? Oh. I hope he's okay. Mira, Chad. Si. No está funcionando. No es un sorpresa. What is the meaning of this? The meaning of what, Mr. Mayor? I ordered this task completed an hour ago. Oh, I, um, you did? You have failed me for the last time. Uh, I don't get it. Chet, it's not working out. <sighs> Fired again? I understand you requested a transport shuttle, and oh no. Hello, hello taxi. I need three pints of goat's milk. What is your destination? Empire Market. Oh, there. Here's the directions. I know how to get there. Is there something I can help with, Chad? Me, the ghost. No, well, yes, actually. How can I find a place to work where I fit in? Where I'm happy? Chad, you already know the answer to that. I do? Chad, look in front of you. It's right on the tip of your nose. Yes, I know what I must do. Farewell, Chad. We'll see each other again soon. Uh, do I pay you? Hey, Chad! You back! Hi, Chad. Randy, I demand my old job back. Chad, we've been over this before. And I'm not leaving this store until I get it. I can stay here all week, all month, forever until you return the day shift to me. You can't do that, Chad. We don't allow loitering around here. Ah, but you forget. I know the rules. As long as I buy something once every hour, you cannot kick me out. You do whatever you want. I'm not going to give you your old job back. We shall see. I can comb through the entire store, buy everything that's on sale, and then don't I'll- Don't bother. I was bluffing. I have no money. Oh no! We have only one hour to get my job back. We can cut the power to the store! I don't get what... Oh, wait. Uh, good luck, Jeremy. Oh, you. What's troubling you, Chad? I sense a disturbance in your feelings. No, everything's fine. I'll have my job back in 56 minutes. What about Clint? I can probably avoid him. I have some information for you. Really? What? Clint hates you. Oh, I had no idea. I must go now. But I have a different way of leaving now, a much more economical way. Ah! 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 He's right. I must deal with Clint once and for all. I recognize you. You're the day manager, right? No, I... Uh, yes, I am. See these cookies? Yesterday they were 99 cents. Today they're a dollar four. That's price gouging, okay? That's illegal. You're right. I, uh, my name's Clint, by the way. I gouged those cookies. I dare you to complain about me. I will! <laughs> No 
idea how long he's gonna stay here or what he's going to do. I need Chad out of this store as soon as possible, Clint. I'll take care of it. And if any employee tries to help him with this crazy scheme, there's going to be some serious disciplinary action. <laughs> Ooh, now you're talking. Uh, oh. oh, hi. Hello. Sorry. I mean, hi. H well, um, hi. You know, Chad, maybe you should just get a different job. You don't want to end up like weird Jimmy. You shut up. No, you shut up! I happen to like this job. It is my destiny. Okay. And what's more, you should not have stood me up on our second date. At least I deserve a little common courtesy. You're right. Sorry, Chad. Maybe we can be friends? I'd like that. Oh, and maybe you could use this. More power to you. Yes, more power to me. Hello, I need three pints of goat's milk, a goat's hoof, a goat's foot, and a goat. My name is Clint, and I think you're a big a-hole. He made me feel funny. Your baby is ugly. What? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Our baby is beautiful! We're never coming here again. <laughs> Admiral, you came out of light speed, too close to the system. That day manager, Clint, he's crazy and he's dangerous. And you're gonna stay there until you learn some manners. Hey, how's it going? Shh. Let's wait for a lot of your shot of customers, Clint. Clint, I've been getting a ton of complaints about you today, and frankly, some of them are hard to believe. Well, if this is about the guy I supposedly yelled at and slapped, he's full of total crapola. Randy to the front of the store to deal with the angry customers. Randy to the front of the store. We're going to talk about this later in my office, Clint. What the F? I haven't been rude to anybody since I lost my name tag. Peter! <laughs> Trapped! There's something alive in here. I've got a bad feeling about this. Excuse me, can you tell me? Oh! Oh! Only two minutes left. I hope Commander Wickstrom can power down the station in time. minutes, jerky, and you haven't bought anything. So now I'm gonna kick your butt out. Come on, Jeremy. <laughs> you gotta watch out for those raccoons. They bite. The power switch. Too weak. What, this? You want me to turn this off? Oh, I don't know. I have to consult with my... Nope, sorry, can't do it. No! Just joking. <laughs> it seems the tables have turned, my nemesis. Oh, oh, it's dark. <sighs> what do you think, I'm afraid of the friggin' dark? You will be. You will be. Let's end this. Oh, I've been waiting for this for a long time. 
and the dark is not gonna stop me. You underestimate the power of the dark, huh? Emergency power, idiot. Didn't know about that, huh? <laughs> you were the worst day manager ever. It is useless to resist. You are mine, huh? This is so easy. Hey, check that out over there. Hmm? No! <laughs> no, Chad, you are such a loser. You're a loser because you suck. You got your head up your butt. And furthermore, I hate you. You're a total a-hole. A total asshole. He's right. I am a failure. Chad, don't listen to him. Lord Vader, I believe in you. You. What did I tell you about that stupid helmet? No! No! <laughs> 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 Everyone here believes in you. No, they don't. They all despise me. Hey! I believe in you. Chad, Chad we believe, believe in you. I believe in you, Chad. I also believe in elves. I believe in you. Chad! Correo and Wisteth. Chad, I'm the mayor, and I believe in you. I believe in you. I found the goat's milk. Okay, everybody, stop believing and get back to work. You shoppers, get back to shopping, all right? Turn and face me. What now? A lemon? Is that all you got? It's all I need. That's how it happened. Clint destroyed three crates of lemons, then threw himself onto the new lettuce display. I think he has mental problems. So, he quit? Yes. And I'm a little worried about that. After all, Clint's father does own Empire Market. That explains a lot. At least he does for the time being. There is talk of a big corporate chain buying out the store. That's gonna mean a lot of changes around here. I see. It's a good thing I saved this. Now, Chad, you're going to need to make some changes in your attitude. What? Uh, I mean, yes, my master. Welcome back, Chad. Wow, Chad, I can't believe how you took care of Clint. I didn't know you had it in you. Thank you. So, Chad, if you ever want to go on that second date, I'm free every night this week. Um, uh, maybe. I have to check my schedule. Uh, give me a call. No, I'll call you. Do you have my number? Commander Wickstrom, I sense that aisle five needs cleaning. We shall require your broom. Hmm, interesting. Commander Wickstrom, I have plans for Empire Market. I am most displeased with the apparent lack of progress on the new deli display. I want to tighten security in the dairy locker. We will double the number of troops guarding it. What's more, 